Hey, what's going on? Back with another one. Back with another one. Um, yeah, I had to redo my recording and then things like that went messed over a second. But pretty much like I was speaking on the situation where I did with my recent recordings like this morning, Sunday daily. I'm just coming back with another one just just to get my clarity on why I said I said on the morning recordings that y'all heard and I streamed whatever, you know, just a couple of minutes. The reason I think these guys are irrelevant is the the way they subscribe to them. So I say they don't count. No, it counts through your views. The people that follow him is understandable. He can't crack a million on YouTube because he ain't talking about nothing. He's not that interesting. There's people that like him and there's people that don't like neither one of them. So that debate tells where YouTube is. This is what they're trying to promote. They're desperate for some views and content. This will blow over in four months. You will never hear this again. This reminds me of three, I will say three, three years ago, 2023 years ago during the pandemic when Mazunga, AKA Dirk Nowitzki, um, was facing Mr. Fidnelli, AKA Mr. Fantastic on his panel and zero barely saved him. I said this, that's what it reminds me of and what BMT is trying to connect to and BMT is correct. What well, he's not correct on. No, it's not going to be, you'll have low version, low tier so-called white people debating anger, man. That's all it is. Y'all not debating nobody of high caliber that went to school, went to schools down here in Georgia that have great credentials on these subjects. You ain't debating them in eight colleges. They're in the echo chamber. Everybody's got their own echo chambers on the internet. I don't have an echo chamber. My echo chamber is very small. Okay. I do go around people's in the comment section and debate people. We could talk about that for hours. I did that on someone else, else's channel. But when they come over here, they get crushed over here. When I host a debate or discussions and things like that, they don't want to, they want to be in complicit of that. I bring information. I read. Most of people hate reading. They don't want to read correctly. Yeah, they can read, but they don't want to read correctly. They don't read about a bunch of bullshit from the entertainment side. That's our problem. We love too much entertainment, but not educational stuff. And there's a reason why that is still the main problem, why he has those subscribers. Like my man said, Dark Wayne said it best. It's because of entertainment. That's why you can listen to them 12 to, uh, 11 to 12 hours over nonsense because YouTube promotes that. They pick and choose who they want to get off here. I try to tell y'all, y'all don't understand Google and YouTube. Google controls what YouTube does. If you're a threat to Google products and ads, you're out of there. And then YouTube as a as a a medium won't exist either. They cut us all off. They cut that whole website and sell it to somebody and then they shut it down. They can do that. Look what they did to Tumblr. Look what they did a lot of websites. Y'all don't understand that this is a political move in 2024. I told y'all this two years ago. This is going to happen. All this stuff is happening for a reason. It's it's political. This can be turned around next year. See, it's it's about money in the, the day because money is they they little so called power, but that ain't the real power. The real power is control the influence of the propaganda. What's on the screens? That's real power. Money is just a tool of power, but it's not the sole power. How the world works? No, the people in power don't believe in that. They fool y'all to believe that y'all believe in the lie. Shout out to uh, George Maker for saying that y'all believe in the lie. Yes, they believe in the lie because they're socially programmed like what you got now. These weak debates, weak ass debates about gender and all this other nonsense. And they can't debate with a lick. So don't, don't waste your time, man. That's that young Turk shit. That's the stuff that you see in places that you don't want to hear all the time. But it's pretty much the same across the board. But yes, next month, yeah, it's so-called Black History Month. We're going to talk about it. I'm going to clown niggas like that, that are cooning on here. And it's pretty much here. And I talk my little historical stuff. And that's pretty much it. You know, I, I really get into it. You know, I haven't seen that on realhistory.com. Shout out to my boy. He He's doing great work. I don't know if he redid the website. He did a great job. I've been talking about this stuff for years and years. That's what my content is actually about in the beginning of those early years of YouTube of this channel and a lot of research. So yeah, you know, evidence is coming out and they lying by history as always. And it's pretty much the same. 
And he tried to label that as Jacobian. See, you see how racially he is? That's why I can't debate somebody like that. He's a joke. And he's all on throwing up the, the race card, they would say, and try to call me a conservative. Dude, I'm a moderate. I'm far from conservative. Conservatism don't even matter. I'm conservative in the household, but when it comes to being outside of public, I'm morally moderate. I'm morally a little bit fair, but I ain't no liberal. I'll never be a liberal. I'm not a, a uh, utilitarian person. That's what that means. I'm not even that. So yeah, man, like realhistory.com, I've been showing stuff like that, man. I've, I've been, I've been hip to what's going on in the atmosphere and, Things like that nature. But yeah, dies like Blue Destiny is a joke, bro. Like I, I can't take I can't take him serious or the engendered man, Mr. Enigma, angry man. I can't take none of them motherfuckers seriously, man. They're jokes to me. Cause all they do is complain about the same old stuff over and over and over and over again about content. They don't have a foundation of what they're talking about. They get on panels and scream and yell. And, and Blue Destiny would fit in on the Lapeef network. He'll fit in on the Lapeef network, but the problem is he wants all the control. Guess what he's going to get? He's going to get millions of subscribers from niggas. That's what he's doing. But if he does that, he's going to be up there where Alvin Preach is. And once he get there, he's not going he gonna to forget about you niggas. All he has to do is come on these panels and people that side with him, that's how his channel is going to grow. And then he's going to say, I did it. No, you went on panels where niggas were. And got the content and you left. You did what Mr. Mr. Real Estate did. Mr. Real Estate did the same thing and got his content and went. He's the world champion of the LBM Coliseum. Like I said over Ramil's. You don't see Ramil no more. And shouts out to Ramil. He's doing his own thing and living his life, man. Destiny, you got to do the same thing. My advice to you, just leave these niggas alone and just get your content and dip. It's easy to do that. It's easy to do that. Watch what I'm going to say. He will be on Lapeef real soon. If they saw that debate with Angry Man, he's going to be on Lapeef. I promise you that. If he likes these conversations, I recommend Destiny go to the Lapeef network. He'll get some shine. Because them women love them some white boy with blue hair. Because they weird too. Our women's been finished psychologically damaged. And they'll defend that white boy. Watch what I tell you. Anti will have a damn fit and it'll be over for them niggas, bro. It's over for them. It's over for them. So what my man Darkwing said, those niggas right here, it's over for them. Okay? Nobody's not going to mess with them no more. They're going to mess with Destiny. That's what he's trying to do, level the playing field. But they can't produce content. Y'all like them niggas. It is what it is. There's division amongst us in these circles. But it ain't all. It's, It's divided in many parts. So white folks can't pinpoint us as a group so-called white people so when people get caught up on the nonsense they don't understand what's going on and what's happening but the same people talk about the same stuff don't understand how the world works and especially our people because they misled by them but in the news media you see this all the time but you don't see this anywhere but you understand what is happening right now but you get people caught up in their emotions and that's just how it is. But, you know, itching a little bit, but I just don't see people get caught up on a lot of things, you know, but that that's, that's just here nor there. That's just here nor there. And then again, you just <laughs> it be in the moment. But then again, you know, but ain't nobody scaring the camera up. I used to camp up outside a lot, but it's just like you get into the motions and that's it. But then again, you just you see what you can get. But normally people just get caught up on a lot of things. So, again, let's see this right quick. Let's see if I got a windscreen for a minute. I was going to flex a little bit. Take this off. And it's pretty much the same, but you know, that's how people get caught up. And then, and then again, you just understand that most people just don't care for those guys like that. But anyways, as what I'm saying, a lot of people just don't want to just admit that they're wrong all the time, but you got narcissists on both sides, 
but especially the ones the liberals are the ultra narcissist uh, narcissistic people all the time they the main ones they think they always write all the time and they really not that's 95 percent liberals man that's like these dudes they ain't conservative they liberal that's what destiny gonna find out these so-called red pill space they're liberal just like him ass backwards and don't know shit about anything but throwing shots at each other how pathetic how pathetic let me let me change something real quick i love the way that that sounds it's a magnet it's a little light flex a little light flex <laughs> it's a little light flex. I, I i like this better than the windscreen i was i was testing it out i said you know yeah, the windscreen's cool. It, it's it's cool. It's cool, but I got my money's worth. It, it's a gift, by the way. But you know, but you may not see it on live streams, but you'll you'll hear it in recordings. You'll see it on the recordings. But it's it is what it is. But I understand that people just get caught up on the wrong stuff and they just like I don't understand why people are talking about it. But what, when I first saw that debate, it, it, it's just a joke to me, man. Like, I, are we still talking about the same old stuff? Like, so why do these so-called red pills please talk about this or that? Like, y'all ain't debate him on nothing, on nothing else. That was like to argue. Y'all ain't got no points. Y'all didn't share no points at all. Y'all didn't break no talking points. But it's just like what it is, you know. My internet's all bad. Oh man, yeah, it's probably done. You know, I'm just gonna keep it as it is because it's it's ridiculous. My internet act up. It's, it gets you after a while. Damn, I don't have to do that. I I don't like restreams is cool, but it it gets janky every now and then. I have to be careful. I have to make my stuff short. I have to measure it. See what's going on with the connection. I don't have to switch. When I record, it's pretty much it. So, yeah, it's on my other one. Okay. I want to take certain things off. Like some things, I'm just, I'm going to knock this off. Yeah. Because that, that's probably hurting it. Because if I have something playing in the background, you know, the stream, it, it'll mess up my internet. I, it's it's weird, but I'm not going to get into that. Well, when you're recording, that's, that's basically what it is. That's, I have to deal with that. I have to deal with that in the future. That's going to be fixed in my recordings and things like that. So, you know, the internet can be janky. That's why I'm careful on live streams. Cause I don't know what I got playing in the background. I just turn everything off and then just, just focus on the content and my information and things like that. And then if I want to play a video, I just play it and put it up on here and through the mic, whatever you want me to say, but it's pretty much the same. Like, Deslock, man, De Destiny, Blue Destiny, wherever your name is, man. Don't waste your time on that. You want to go on the Lapeef Network, just go on the Lapeef Network. It's pretty much the same. You know, you just do your thing and then just like, I guarantee you'll get more subscribers than uh, the mild and gender enigma man of all time. Yeah, so with that, I just want to say, you know, I'm enough talking about it. I'm just speaking my mind, but this is what we resort to. So when you see debates like that, you just go crazy with it. So with that, I'm out. Signing off. Until next time. Peace.